In the late 1800s, Henry Zeglin broke up with his girlfriend, who was devastated by the breakup. She was so heartbroken that she tragically took her own life. In a strange turn of events, the girl's brother, seeking revenge for his sister's death, went after Henry Zeglund. He shot Zeglund and, believing he had succeeded, took his own life as well. But here's where the story takes a jaw-dropping twist. Henry Zeglund was not dead. The bullet had grazed his face, lodged in a tree, and didn't harm him seriously. Years later, Zeglund was working in his garden, where he decided to clear the land. What did he use? You guessed it. Dynamite. Little did he know that the explosion from the dynamite would release the same bullet that had been fired at him years ago. Talk about a mind-blowing twist of fate. That bullet, which should have killed him, had been waiting in that tree all those years, only to come back and find him. 